Wake that ass up early in the morning. The Breakfast Club. Morning, everybody. It's DJ MV Angela Yee, Charlemagne the Guy. We are the Breakfast Club. We got a special guest in the building, Tierra Marie. Yes. She was a little late, Hi. so we got to charge her late fee. Yes, you do. I'm sorry <laughs> yeah. about everybody that. Everybody wants your money, Tierra. Underestimate Damn. the traffic. She ain't got it. I ain't got <laughs> it here. Yeah. You want a late fee? <laughs> What's you, up, Tierra? Now, do you you get it later with payment plan. <laughs> <laughs> do you really not have it? You know. Serious question. I mean, it's cool if you don't. I ain't got it. <laughs> but she would never say if she did have it. Because you owe 50, what, 30 grand? Yeah, 30 grand. And, um, you know, he wanted, I think, 75K. Mm -hmm. But the judge uh, granted 30. So, um... But let's back up. Why do you owe 50 cent $30,000? Okay. Well, he was friends with my ex mm -hmm. who released the sex tape on my page and 50 reposted it. And it was just very coincidental mm -hmm. that he was the only celebrity that posted it, and he's friends with the guy. And you Is he, are they real friends or just associates? I think they were just associates at the mm -hmm. time, and because I think, I think they came together, and um, my ex asked him to post the video or post the picture, whatever the hell he posted, and I think that um, he fifty eventually thought that me and my ex were in cahoots when when that's not true because i don't think they're friends or associates anymore well a lot of people reposted that video and picture though uh not a lot of celebrities no so why talk i mean celebrities are still regular people on social media though no but he was wrong he was wrong what? did he take it down i wouldn't have done it but i don't you know that's did the social he, media yeah, thing yeah he, he took it down of course he got reported you mm -hmm. know they're not gonna let something stay up like that that right. that vulgar and but you still yeah. speak to your ex right um, I haven't spoken to him. After no. the sex tape, y'all didn't speak to each other? Yeah, after the sex tape, we did speak to each other because I wanted to believe he didn't do it. You he know, he like hacked. he was saying that he got hacked. He mm -hmm. was saying that his other girl or girlfriends whom I had just found out about the day before. You found out he was cheating on you? Well, I found out he was cheating on them. With <laughs> so, you? Right. Okay. <laughs> so, um... Yeah, so he was making up all these different excuses, and I'm just like, so if Curtis is your friend, why would he repost a sex tape of your girlfriend if y'all supposed to be friends? Right. It just didn't make sense to That's me. That's a lot to happen at once, too, to be traumatizing. Like, not only oh, yeah. is there a sex tape out, but then you also find out that your boyfriend was cheating on you. With and that's women. how it happened. Um, we shot a scene where I ended up finding out about the girls. And so I told him, like, I, I don't want anything to do with you. I'm done. Like, drop my house key off. Like, because we were kind of serious, I mm -hmm. thought. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, and uh, he texted me back, like, oh, my God, Tierra. I mean, instantly texted me back. Oh, my God, Tierra, somebody stole my phone with our sex tapes in them. And so I'm so like. So you thought it was a plot immediately. Yeah, I'm like, oh, I know what you up to. So I got mad. I was pissed. I just was like in a rage. And then the next day, the shit was released. And so I just went over his house and just started busting out his windows and just like going crazy. I was like, I just blacked out. Was that on camera? That's or vandalism. No? I know. Is that on camera or no? <laughs> but it wasn't his car to begin with. I didn't know that until. After um, after we broke up and everything was in the news, this guy reached out to me like, this is my car. He stole it. He has two of my G-Wagons. These are not his cars. So he was a fleeing felon at the time. Hold on, I'm oh adding all this gosh. up. 30000 for 50 Now I've seen busted <laughs> car windows for a random screen. Uh, 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 How much that cost? No, How because much first of all, 5, 000, I don't have to five, pay that. Piece? Yeah, 5000 No, 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 no. Well, I don't because he stole the I don't have to pay. That. Exactly. And the guy didn't charge me. Hold on, so five thousand a window. They have about twenty thirty. Oh, five thousand for a window? I don't wow. think that's yeah, accurate. Yeah, a G wagon about thirty five hundred. Okay, think. so you have fifty k so far, Tierra. Let's go. Okay, all right. Well, let's go. <laughs> what else would you like? Oh, so about? you know, wait, wait, yeah, so you bust out the windows. Was the camera taping when you bust out the windows? Was no, the, the camera show, was, was not. But uh, <laughs> after I busted out the windows, I guess Akbar, because you know, I guess he wanted. Fame or whatever. Who's that boy? Your ex boyfriend? Yeah. Okay. So he called the camera. So I, I walked downstairs and the cameras are all over. And so, like, this was a real moment. I've never shot a scene like in real time until the that day. That fast? Yes. They, they, they canceled another scene. I mean, it's, it's LA. You know, they can get there and they got there. And I walked downstairs. If you see the scene, I'm like, I look crazy. 
uh, like just crazy, like a crazy woman. And um, they shot it, and I was like, I just this is all you want, you know what I'm saying? Is Attention. camera time, mm-hmm. yeah. Why and now sh- I think he has to be feeling some type of way that he's not involved in the situation anymore, right? Because it's succeeded him. So he's not all he's not on love and hip hop anymore. Um. Not that I know of. I don't think so, no. Now, now why do people... sue more than 50 Cent? Because it was a I bunch sued of him, too. Yeah, you, you were in the middle of a loss. I, I sued 50. Um, I, I sent a cease and desist to, like, Pornhub and a bunch of the sites. But, yeah. It and costs you money to sue, though, well. unless you got it somebody does. to do it pro bono. Well, it does cost money to sue. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So you spent about another $50,000 just suing people. Well, retainer fees and all that stuff. Retainer fees, it wasn't fifty thousand. Oh, did they do it for pro bono? How much you think? Did they do it um, pro bono? Well, she did. Uh, mm-hmm. Lisa did, but I had other attorneys too. How much did you? Because I did a criminal investigation as well. How much did you pay in lawyer fees? Um, I probably came up to like only like fifteen. All right, fifteen thousand. Oh, what are you wow. writing down over there, man? You see how much all this is costing, young Tierra. That's all. 15, now let's all talk right. about this though, because you did have an open lawsuit against Akbar, but yes. you still were talking to him at that time because you did still think that perhaps he was telling the truth, right? But yeah, because every time he would reel me in, and I was just like so vulnerable and like just lost and confused at the time, he would reel me in like, "Oh, uh, I know who did it. I know who did it. I know who did it. I got the proof right here." So one time he like, I got the proof right here. I'm like, well, I'm on my way to Vegas. And so he's like, well, meet me in this parking lot or whatever. And so I'm like, all right, cool. So he's like, I got the proof. And so my plan was to meet him in the parking lot and call um, Lisa to come and serve him because they they couldn't find him to serve him. So I was like, okay, I'm going to get to the parking lot. Then I'm going to call them up and serve him. Mm As soon as I got to the parking lot, he ambushes me. Him and this other guy ambushed me, a guy that I thought was a friend, ambushed me and um, had me on camera. And it was a test. And I I, I, I felt miserably. How'd you feel? Because I I, re, I reacted and I started going crazy. Like, like I was ready to fight. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? When I should have just been like, you know what? Okay. <laughs> mm-hmm. You got it, buddy. What was the point of him taping you? Because he was 50 Cent's little friend and trying to save him at the time like you know he was trying to save 50 and and, and get the get the case dropped but 50 ended up winning the lawsuit though right he didn't win the lawsuit since i didn't since that that situation happened mm-hmm. lisa dropped the case because she was like i can't represent you no more because it just looks crazy well, it looked and like so, what you and all well, was back together that's what he was taking yeah, it, it looked like, like you guys were <clears> looking <throat> around hanging out with each other yeah right 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 so however I, he well, made his name so so why drop the kid so why would she drop the case with 50 then? I, she just said it looked crazy. She just dropped the whole thing. That's I just got an email and I had to come up to her office and I signed off. Okay, you dropped the case. You no longer represent me. But on top of that, I couldn't get anybody else to pick the case back up. So basically the case was just going on. So the judge was like, okay, you, uh, hey, you lost. You got to pay him his legal fees. Yikes. That's why I have... To pay fifty. Have you paid him anything at all, or nothing at all? Um, I paid him fifty cent the other day. How did you pay him? You check. Mm-hmm. And you sent it to the office? No, I Western Union did. You no, I'm Western just kidding. Oh, oh, I'm I kidding. Said, uh, <laughs> but that's why you was at the check cashing place. Yeah, no, it was a joke. Mm. So how long uh, does it? How long do you? So when, <laughs> in a case like this, how long do you have to pay somebody? Can you work out a payment plan? Yeah, like, how does I mean, that work? listen, I my court date is uh, later this month. Mm-hmm. I didn't go to the first one because my grandfather passed. So I was in Detroit. And um, my attorneys went, it, and they got me an extension. Okay. So, so we'll figure everything out when I go. If you could, do you think all of this was worth it? If you could go back, would you still have gone through this process, the suing and all of that type of stuff? Yep, I would have, but I wouldn't have uh, believed, uh, oh, boy. Akbar. Yeah. You wouldn't have gone to meet him. I, I wasn't going to say his name anymore. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But, yeah, I wouldn't have gone to meet him. I wouldn't have, like, tried to hear him out. Like, I would have just changed my number then and then just proceeded with my case. Have you ever tried to reach out to 50 just to say, let me get 50 on the phone? No, for what? He's already, like, y'all know Kurt is a mess. Mm-hmm. So, mm-hmm. no. Does Are he you frazzle th- you at all? No, he doesn't. He makes me laugh. He tickles me. He's a very hilarious. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, he's very hilarious. He's actually actually been bringing, bringing out some of my, you know, <laughs> funny side. 
Did you feel like you would get more support, though, based off of the whole situation that people would be more sympathetic toward you? Because it is difficult when you have something so personal leak out that you didn't want to obviously anybody to see. So did you feel like people were not supportive in general? Um, I think people were supportive. It was like half and half, mm-hmm. to be honest. You know, a lot of women were supportive and a lot of men were just like, y'all know that smut did that herself. You know what I'm saying? And I don't even post or I I don't post regularly. It seemed, it so seemed why? like that, though. Not, not the smut spot, but right. it, it seemed like you did because why? it seemed like after it came out, we seen you and Akbar together. So right. it was like, if you're that mad that my boyfriend released this tape, there's nothing to talk about. Like, we're not together right. no more. And then the fact that y'all were still together just seemed like it was another love and hip hop. Yeah, well, we weren't together. We just had met up in a couple of places because I wanted to hear him out. Mm-hmm. He was saying yeah. he didn't release it. He was saying he, he got was, hacked. He was, Someone else put it out, the girl. He's still sticking to that to this day. Mm-hmm. That's why I had a criminal investigation open, too. What, what did the criminal investigation come up with? Um, well, when they dropped the civil, they dropped it's everything. Okay. Yep. But the criminal investigation was to, to find out where it came from. Mm-hmm. Like, it didn't come from me. You know, where did it come from? Mm-hmm. So what kind of space are you in now? Because I know things have to be somewhat fragile. Like, you did go to rehab, and you were having issues mm-hmm. that you were battling. Then having so many things happen so publicly on Love and Hip Hop that yeah. people get to experience, and then all this happens. So mentally, like, what kind of space are you in? Um, Right now, I'm dating myself. You mm-hmm. know, I, I came straight out of rehab, rehab and I started dating Oh boy, and um, I just didn't give myself enough time to get into a routine and get into self love all the way. Mm-hmm. You know, like I jumped straight into a relationship. And then you said rehab. It was it was rehab for alcohol or was it for drugs? Yes, for alcohol. For alcohol. Mm-hmm. So you 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 no more no no longer drinking. And you, no no I I can't say it. I haven't drank and especially when that situation was going down, like I was out of it every day because I just was so humiliated. So I, what, didn't what, show I, don't think, I, don't, I don't think any of this is good for you, Tia. I, I think, don't either. Yeah, I think that, uh, and, I, and you're putting on a brave face, which is good, but I feel like you hurt. Of course. Yeah. I mean, mm-hmm. I was humiliated, mm-hmm. you know, for, for the world mm-hmm. to see. You know, it, it happens, but mine was just on a platform. Mm-hmm. And not, not only social media, but TV, you know, so... Yeah, it was like a double whammy. And it, it will take a toll on you when people are clowning you every single day. Yeah. Whether if they're catching you in the check cashing place or 50 cents, something like it's got to weigh on you a little bit. No, none of that weighs on me, no. No. So what weighs on you then? Um, what, what, shit, I just think about that damn sex tape and what this all stemmed from. Mm-hmm. That's what weighs on me. Is it still out there? Yes, I'm still having to like get it taken down from porn sites. Mm. It's crazy. Now, wait, wait, um, so... What happened to Tiara Marie? And the reason I asked that is Tiara Marie was this, this little young girl we all grew up with. She made we this did. record. She was signed to Rockefeller. Yeah, she was young. She grew up. We pretty much. She was see, about to go to the prom when yeah. she found out she was getting dropped. She yeah. was very young. Yeah, high very very still. young. And and then what what happened? Like why the love and hip hop? Because it seemed like Tiara went from this good girl, sweet, cute to. Love it, hip hop, and oh my gosh, she's fighting, she's throwing drinks and everything else. Well, you know what? I'm like, don't start none, won't be none. Mm. Any situation, if you look at it on love and hip hop, I never start shit with people. They pick with me. And then love and hip hop is one of those shows they'll tell you, okay, you're filming today. And then you walk into some bullshit and you're caught off guard. And I don't know how to really like control myself when I'm caught off guard. So, yeah, that's, I guess, what happened. Do you regret loving hip-hop at all? Um, I regret some of the things that I've done on there, yeah. Some of the situations that I had to go go through, some of the people that I trusted. Yeah, absolutely. Did Ray J reach out to you at all since you guys at one point were tight and I know he had to feel like this was traumatic for you? No, because I don't have his info and he doesn't have mine. Mm-hmm. Like, that, that phase is, like, far removed. But if y'all see each other, y'all still cool. Right? Yeah, if we see each other, there is always like, hey, what's up, how you doing? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Is 50 really garnishing your love and hip-hop checks? Um, <laughs> no, not yet. I mean, I haven't he even will, went to though. court. No, okay. uh, no, we're gonna go to court, mm-hmm. and then I'm gonna see w- what options I have. So the court's gonna cost you more money? Or you, you got a lawyer for that, too? Or? N- yes, I have a lawyer for that. Jesus Christ. Oh, but this lawyer wasn't that expensive. How so much what? was he? Why? I'm just keeping you a tab. Sure you really trying to tab? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> so, so I'm just trying to, cause I'm trying to add this up to see if it's worth it. I don't think any of this is worth so it. So why man. continue to do it's love not, and hip hop? It's if, not. If, if it's like it's, it seems like it's taking a toll on you. Like you think? Hold on, let her finish that. You say you say you, you said it's not worth it. 
I mean, no, it's not worth. It's not worth um, all this money that I'm coming out of. Exactly. And yes, it stems from love and hip hop. You know what I'm saying? Because they brought him on, and then he was friends with Fifty, and then Fifty released this tape, and then I take my dumb ass back to him, and then my case get dropped, and then mm-hmm. I have to pay Fifty Cent. You know what I'm saying? Like. It's just all over some shit that people do every day. Mm-hmm. People do freaky shit yeah. behind the scenes. You know 50, what I'm saying? 50 counter sued you, right? Did he counter sue? I... He wanted me to pay for it. I guess if, if that's what you call it, he yeah. wanted me to pay for his legal fees. Yeah, so he didn't actually like sue you no. for like defamation? No. Or like, okay. Hell no. You. No, and he can't do that because I, I he can't do that. Now, how did the single... I will win that. Mm-hmm. How did the single do? You put the single out because you had oh to... Oh, my God. It was supposed to just be like silly and... Like, just like, you know, fun okay, song. I'm having it. fun with your ass. You know, you want to keep going back and forth, let's go back and forth. And um, people actually like it, so. <laughs> but you have to be very careful about the things you put into the universe. Because yeah. if you keep saying, I ain't got it, I ain't got it, I ain't got it, all these lawyer fees and all this other stuff going to start to add up. <laughs> I ain't going to have it. And you really ain't going to have it. <laughs> For real. Yeah. But, no, I mean, it's all in fun and games. Did he really trademark the I ain't got it phrase? Um, I don't know if he did or not. I mean, I didn't care about that. Mm-hmm. Right, because you you're not going to do nothing. Yeah, yeah, I'm not doing... What am I going to do with it? Why sell a couple of him? T-shirts? Call him. Let him and Tierra talk, man. Oh, my God. Maybe that's off air. <laughs> you don't think so? Like, do it now. <laughs> Call Fifth, man. Call Fifth, man. <laughs> Let him and Tierra talk. Let's try to work this out. This is whack. Like, it's so point. You don't think it's pointless and petty? Absolutely, but I'm going to play the petty game. Because at first Why? I wasn't. But at first I wasn't. Mm-hmm. I let him, like, drag me for at least, like, a right. month. Mm-hmm. And then I'm like, you know what? Fuck you. You, know you came back with some shots, you know? But yeah. I, I just think after a while, somebody got to be the bigger person. Well, I mean, at this point, since he was the little person at first, he needs to be the bigger person. Right. Maybe I mean, look, people have apologize. pride. You can't just, you know, do that and expect yeah. people to never respond yeah. if you want to yeah. respond. And I think for you, like you said, you did it in a way that it was a single. You were joking around. You were playing yeah. back. And then people just actually like it. And you have a whole EP coming out, too. Yes, a whole EP. <laughs> it's called Wanted, <coughs> and it'll be out in the next month. <laughs> call Fifth, man. I just texted him, man. For what? Oh, just my call God. He's taping, man. He's taping. Goodness gracious. <laughs> <laughs> Tell him to call me. Goodness gracious. Goodness gracious. Right, I gotta I catch a flight, that guys. One in a long I, time. I don't even want to leave Tierra oh, here with y'all. Oh, now you want to leave because 50 might call. No, I just don't want to leave Tierra here with y'all. I feel bad that I have to catch a flight. Oh, she was a little late. Oh, my God, Angela Yee, the um, fun killer. We trying to make peace in here. You know what I'm you saying? You over here counting up how much money she spent. Yes, because I'm trying to get her to stop spending money. Because this is ridiculous. Well, I mean, it is ridiculous. I mean, they started with me, though. Mm-hmm. And I just made a mistake. So I had to take the L. Did you, when 50 first posted the video, did you ever think to yourself, or did somebody in your team say, oh, you can get a bag if you sue Fifth for posting that? Um, somebody put that in the attorney, Did the attorney reach out to you? Was that the one? I reached out to one of my attorneys, and, and he put me with Lisa. Why? Because somebody told you, like, you can get a bag from Fifth for doing He was this. just saying, like, you need to civilly sue and criminally sue. Mm. So that's what it was. Yeah. I had to stand up for myself. And, you know... I just, like I said, went back to Akbar, and um, I said his name. Um, yeah. You're not, you're not supposed to say his name? She doesn't I want don't, to. I don't, I don't need therapy to or something, Tierra. No, I'm, I'm you, not. You, Shut the hell up, no, Charlamagne. You, do, you look visibly frazzled. Like, I'm you're shaking. Yes, you frazzled. are. You're I quivering. am not shaking. You are. All right. Give her a hug, man. No, no, I don't no, need I a hug. She said no. <laughs> it, it, no, 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 because if he feels that kind of energy, I don't want to give that to him. So there's, there's some things that are funny and some things are not, but you look like you need a hug. And, 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 and like, I'm not really? even joking. Am, not do even I joking. look like I've been crying or something? Yes. Sometimes I think that things happen and people don't look at people as human beings either in situations like this. Like people joke around, they do stuff, but, but you don't it affects think people. that yeah, Tierra's really a Yeah, it definitely human affects being. me. This, I'm a woman. I'm her, human. Mm-hmm. Yes. And I, I mean, one of my most intimate moments was exposed to the world. So hell, fuck yeah. Mm-hmm. It affected me. Mm-hmm. But I'm that average, I don't even remember me. that tape, though. Good. Like, I remember, like, I see more of the aftermath, like, you and 50 going back and forth. Right. Than the, I don't even really yeah. recall the tape. Yeah, but that's what it all stemmed from. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, he posted the tape, and I took action. Was there ever a, a, a period where you said, you know what, I'm going to try to make the most of this tape situation, see if I can sell it to Vivid or somebody? And You know, I never really thought about that. Mm-hmm. 
I never really thought about that. Because only you can do that. Yeah. Like he, well, I, but, I think both of y'all have to sign off. But. but you know what? It's like it's already out there. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So why do you think Vivid would want to pay money for it? I think Kim K was already out there. No, it wasn't. It wasn't. They sold it before it hit. Oh, they got, you, got, you, got you. Got you. Got you. So they knew it was coming. Mm-hmm. I didn't. I woke up one morning and saw my face on the fucking internet. On my page. My friend hit me like, take that shit off your page. And I'm like, what shit? So I look and it's on there. Mm. So he hacked you or he had your password? He had my password. Mm. So you know it was you know it was him. I know it was him. So then there's no question who it was. All I, along. Yeah, yeah. But he's beginning. claiming that one of his girls did it. Okay. From so his, his phone. phone. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Cause this is the day after right. I found out about his chicks mm. and it kind of went down that day so no more sex tapes after this no more no more sex yourself. tapes no more pictures I am I am scarred I <laughs> guess you and visibly together? scarred um, for about nine months and you let him tape you yeah damn Sierra mm-hmm. yep okay. I sure did you know people do it all the time though they like, definitely do you know you just got bitch niggas and he <laughs> you know what I'm saying that, that would do some shit like that Bitch niggas? Yeah. <laughs> today is National Prayer Day. Have you prayed today? <laughs> yes, I pray every day. Okay. Every day that I wake up. And every day at 11. Like 11, 11, 8, 11, 9, 11, 10, 11, 1, 11, 2, 11. You got eight minutes. Okay, <laughs> well then I'm going to say a prayer. All right, y'all take care of my girl, Tia. <laughs> we about to leave. I'm not I got to leave because I got me and the lions did. <laughs> I'm sorry. We about okay. to get what 50 Okay. Text me after Trying to get him online right I now. I will. I got somebody walking over to him to give him the phone. Oh, you got somebody walking to him to get to the phone? Yes. Uh-huh. Would you like a sandwich? A sandwich? No, I'm good. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Would you like some tea? So now what's, what's, ne- what's next for Tiara Marie? Somebody you get Tiara some tea. So the EP, and then I'm working on my own reality show. And, um, you want to Scott? No, I'm not, I'm not working with Mona Scott. You want to sue Mona, don't you? Why? No, I don't want to sue Mona. Why? You don't like, you don't, you don't like how she's pre- represented you on the show? You know, it's not her. Mm-hmm. It's a team of people. Like, Mona, like, she watches the playbacks. Like, she's not in the story room writing the stories. Got you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, no, it ain't her. She so had, and nobody holds a gun to your head to tell you how to react to situations. You know? That's the whole thing about Love & Hip Hop. What were you doing at the check cashing place anyway? Um, I was there. <laughs> you didn't see the video? No, I, I didn't. I didn't see it. Oh yeah, I was there being funny, making a joke. Oh, you did it on purpose. I, yeah. I just seen. I just seen fifty points, and I was like, oh damn, she's. Oh, I no. thought you was real. I, I thought no, somebody look, just a look on my page, and you'll see the video. Oh. So I was just being funny. I thought somebody that was in the check cashing place took a picture of you and posted it. Yeah, they did, but they didn't know what I was doing. Got you, got you, got you. Yeah. Okay. All right, guys. Oh, wait, is he going to get on the phone? I want to know. I, I think I, you know what? I think now that I think about it, I would love to talk to There you Curtis. go. See, I'm talking about it. Just call him. <laughs> yeah, I'm just, I'm, I'm, I'm Why can't you just dial that? his number? That's because your friend. Because he's taping, and I made his, his, his person with him go walk over to him. What, are you taping power? Him. I don't know. what. I didn't ask. I'm not, I'm not his Oh, you hit his, his man, assistant. and he said he's taping. I hit him first. He didn't reply, so I hit his man, and they said he's taping. Mm. Oh. Well. Damn. So if, if I if I get him on the phone, what's the first thing you would say to 50? I don't know. I don't know either. That's why it's going to be amazing. <laughs> That's why we need to make this. Because you just call him and just see if he picks up. I just up. called him. He didn't answer. That's what I called him. Oh, got you, got you, got I you. I don't know. Call from the 105 number. He might answer that one. He definitely not going to answer that one. He would answer my <laughs> phone number before he'd answer the 105 number, you ass, you jerk. Well, you, I don't know what I would say. Y'all would have to, like, entryway. Well, let's pause for a second and give him time. And then when, when <laughs> he calls, so we'll weird. resume. Okay. You ain't got nowhere to go for, like, 15 minutes, right? Yeah, I'm good. All right, buy her a sandwich. No, I don't need no damn sandwich. Y'all ain't hungry? Mm-mm. Oh. She got, oh, she got money to buy a sandwich. I, had a I didn't say she did it. Oh, okay. <laughs> buy her a sandwich. You ain't hungry like she ain't eat she all said, day. She yes, I'll buy her a sandwich. <laughs> what fifth thing? Yeah, he oh, didn't yeah. hit me back. I would have loved to get y'all on me. the line, man. Because I really think that one conversation, you and fifth would put this behind y'all. <sighs> I really believe that, yo. You hate him? I hate what he did, yeah. I don't hate anybody. I think he was just being a part of the social media. I don't think he was in cahoots with your guy. Like I don't think so. I do, I think too. Was just, I, I do, too. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. That's your buddy. That's my buddy, but he posts everything. Yeah, he posts everything. Nah, day. fuck that. So you think he was fully in cahoots? <laughs> yes, that was supposed to be your friend. I don't think he did that for that. <clears throat> so they really weren't friends then? I don't think so. Not like that. 
Not to post him having a sex tape. I think it was more funny because everybody was talking about it. I really do. I do too. No, but he's the one who kind of really blew the shit up. No, nah. I saw it before Fifth posted. Yeah, it was up before Fifth Somebody, posted. Somebody said it was up, and then Fifth posted it later. No, nah, he posted that shit. It was early in the morning. I remember. I remember, for a fact. Because I woke up, and I ran straight to NoHo 14 and bust every car window out. What is NoHo 14? It is we live. Oh. Mm-hmm. And I'm mad. Cause Wendy had gave me a little advice. <laughs> Wendy Williams. Williams? Yeah, <laughs> she said? said I should have fucked up the pipe exhaust in the engine. <laughs> She's like the windows can get fixed easily. <laughs> you should have really Wendy, did it to him. Wendy would have got you locked up. They would have locked you up for that one. Well, I'm sorry, T. I'm sorry we couldn't get him on the line. I'd love to try to squash it. Yeah, y'all. no, that's fine, honey. God is good, you know. All right, Terry. Give me your Instagrams and Twitters, and we tried. Why are you looking at me like that? Because you get on my nerves sometimes. <laughs> I'm a cancer too, like 50. Oh, okay. Yep. Do you, you have a heart? Um, Do you have I, a heart? Have, I have learned to have empathy over the past few years. That I will say. I do. What is it with you guys? Lack of empathy? Yeah. Um. Very brash. Very like. I don't know. I think that uh, when you have been through certain circumstances, you kind of suppress a lot of your feelings and you don't feel. So it kind of makes you just cold to everything and everybody, but that's not good. So I think when you start being more in tune with your feelings, you start having more empathy for for other people. Because you start worrying about, you start caring about what other people feel. Right. You know what I'm saying? Because now you feel. So now I'm like, damn, how did that, how did what I said to that person affect them? You know? So why don't you teach him that? Oh, no, he's not there yet. 50 not going to ever be there. And he your buddy too? We cool. Uh-huh. I like Fifth. Yeah. I think he's a f- you like him too. You just don't. Y'all just not having a little. I used to like him. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. As and, yeah. And, and when he was clowning everybody else, you probably laughed. But now it's you. It's like no. A- I mean, <laughs> see what I'm saying? <laughs> now it's me. I'm just gonna fight back. Shit, gotcha. fuck it. Gotcha. But what else am I supposed to do? Run? Nah. Lie down? Let him roll me over with a Mack nah. truck? But again, I mean, after a while, it does get petty. On both it does. Parts. It does. Yeah. On both sides. But I don't say anything unless he says something. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So it's like. Leave me the fuck alone. And I'll leave you alone. And I'll pay you your little 50 cent a month. <laughs> Sarah Marie, thank you for joining us. Thank you for having we tried. me. We tried. All right, Tierra. Thank you, guys. I'm sending you positive energy and love. Okay. Air hugs. Thank you. I receive it. <laughs> it's Tierra Marie. It's the Breakfast Club. Good morning.